Ensconced in a district known for its thriving, though hidden, local art scene in Sha Tin is a homegrown Hong Kong startup that has made a name in developing a robot that can detect wildfires on the mainland before it's too late. And then uh, we can open the casing here. It's just like uh, the inside the hood of a car. Yeah. <laughs> so the Founder Rex Sham set up Inside Robotics in 2009 after two failed startups. Alongside partner so Kevin Chan, the, they created uh, these robots. The power grid failure. Precise location of any suspicious heat sources to the control center. Which can pinpoint fires on the mainland before they spread and alert firefighters. Forest fires contribute 20 to 30 percent of global carbon emissions each year. In a random discussion, we say if water is not working, then let's go fire <laughs> and then we go to um, do some research and then we find out that uh, forest fire is the largest um, uh, carbon emission source in the world. It is a really serious issue if carbon trading is coming into uh, practice so that is a lot of money actually. Nearly 4,000 forest fires on the mainland were recorded in 2013, reports the State Forestry Administration. Catastrophic wildfires, meanwhile, tend to recur and cause extensive damage in other countries, including Canada, the U.S. and Australia. 70 robots have since been sold to 10 cities on the mainland since 2013. The business for forest fire detection on the mainland over the next decade is worth over 8.1 billion US dollars, says Sham. The firm is attracting investors. It secured an extra 2 million US dollars of financing last October. The robots will soon be available in Mexico and Indonesia. The next big thing launches later this year. Drones for commercial use. If there is a sick tree or insect invasion, the photosynthesis activities of the oil palms will change. So we detect the changes of the uh, photosynthesis activities and then we can plot the map uh, for the farmers or the uh, plantation owners uh, to show them which part of your plantation is having problem. Beyond the firm's aim to saving the environment is its resolve to inspire entrepreneurs to launch their own startups in a city they've come to know as a hotspot for nurturing creative thought. Kathy Yang, CCTV, Hong Kong.